Hey everybody, it's Matthew from Western Dragon Tea. In this video, what is green tea? This video is going to go into the green tea playlist. For at any point in time you like this video or like tea, go like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook. Green tea is similar to white tea in that it is a similar process with one extra step. Green tea is a very delicate process in the way that they want to keep the tea nice, green, and fresh. So, the tea is typically the first or second leaf from the tea plant, and it is picked very delicately. They don't want to bruise or harm the leaf in any way. They want to keep it green, because if they damage the leaf or bruise it, it's going to let out those essential oils, which are going to react with the air and start to oxidize the leaf. So, after farmers pick the leaves very carefully, they quickly lay the leaves out in the sun to get that solar withering just slightly for a shorter amount of time than typical. And then what they're going to do is take those leaves and they're going to pan bake them. This process stops the enzymes from oxidizing the leaf and that's what gives green tea its green, real fresh color. Here's a look for you guys at home if you want a closer look. This is Dragon Well. It's very common tea in China. You can find it at a lot of markets and other places like that. And it's just a really fine, green, delicate green tea. You can see the greenness in it, but you can also definitely taste it. So with that said, there is a difference between Chinese green tea and Japanese green tea. The Chinese green tea and the Japanese green tea are both cultivated similarly. However, with the Chinese, how they pan bake it to prevent that oxidation process, the Japanese steam their green tea. So if you ever see a difference between Chinese and Japanese green tea, it's because of the pan baking versus the steaming process. So with Chinese green tea, you'll typically get a more of a roasted taste with it. It's going to have more of a vast variety of flavors that you'll find with Chinese green tea. And it's going to be a little bit nuttier. But with Japanese green tea from the steaming process, it's not going to have that cooked flavor as much. It's going to be a lot more similar in taste that you'll find with Japanese green tea. It's going to look a lot greener and a lot fresher. It's kind of almost a little powdery sometimes and it is typically more of a fresh green and it's sharp and it's very strong, but its variety and flavor is definitely not as much as you'll find with Chinese green tea. That's all for this video. If you're interested in this green tea, it's in our shop under green teas, and the link will be in the description below. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next video.